The oceanographic research vessel commissioned by the Tupitak Marmara Research Center came into service on July 1, 2013. As a regional class and medium-sized research vessel, the RV Tupitak Marmara is equipped with oceanographic, hydrographic, and bathymetric devices such as a CTD, multi-water sampler, multi-beam sonar, current profiler, side scan sonar, and a seabed profile scanner. With its current equipment and enhanced navigation facilities, the RV provides important information for the monitoring of marine pollution and the protection of the sea environment by conducting scientific research in Turkish and international seas. Measurements and samplings are conducted in waters up to 3,000 meters deep via two oceanographic cranes, five-ton A-frames, a CTD, and a multi-water sampler, which are all located on the upper deck. Thanks to the wet, dry, and incubation laboratories that are located on the vessel, samples can be taken from the sea and analyzed immediately. In addition to oceanographic devices, there is a dynamic positioning system in the RV for studies that need to be conducted in a fixed position. The location of divers and of any equipment with a transmitter, such as underwater vehicles and measuring devices, can be pinpointed with the USBL acoustic positioning system. Bathymetric maps up to 2,000 meters deep can be created with the multi-beam echo sounder, and current profiling up to 400 meters deep can be acquired by the acoustic Doppler current profiler. The RV can travel for 10 days non-stop with a passenger capacity of 12 crew members and 11 researchers. It provides comfortable cabins for passengers and offers places for training, scientific organizations, and meetings. The RV's kitchen serves traditional Turkish cuisine to the 23 people on board. The RV takes part in the national and international projects funded by ministries, municipalities, universities, public institutions, non-governmental organizations, private sector representatives, and international R&D centers. The RV has also supported some EU projects. The RV has been used in the seas around Turkey for oceanographic research studies, as well as monitoring and controlling marine pollution. The CTD probe, which has a 3,000 meter long data cable, collects water samples from any desired sea depth while simultaneously recording the oceanographic parameters, such as temperature, salt concentration, density, pH balance, chlorophyll, and light transmission. The CTD probe can also determine dissolved oxygen concentrations with high accuracy using the Winkler titration method. The qualitative and quantitative assessments of phylogenetic phytoplanktonic organisms, the primary producers in the sea, are collected from the photic zone using a phytoplankton scoop net. In water samples collected from the sea, chlorophyll assessments are conducted to determine the amount of production done by the primary producers of the sea. Ammonium nitrogen, phosphorus, and silicate assessments of seawater collected from different depths are conducted in a short time so that the amount of nutritional elements and the trophic levels can be determined. Sediment samples from the seafloor are collected using a seafloor mud sampler and are kept secure through several processes. Heavy metals, PCBs, nutritional elements, petroleum hydrocarbons, pesticides, and special polluter assessments are conducted on the RV. Benthic organisms, mussels, and larva samples from various creatures living on the seafloor are also collected from the sediment samples. The deep structure of the seafloor can be mapped out by using the side scan sonar and sub-bottom profiler. Professional divers on the RV use high-definition underwater cameras to capture footage of marine life and the seafloor. The currently under construction remote operated vehicle will also provide access to the seabed. Thank you for your attention. <laughs>